up, internet? Taking a look at the Hydro PTM Pro 750 Watt PSU from FSP. And before we begin, you should know that the brand sent us this item for review, but had no say in what we had to say about it. Sa totoo lang, ang hirap mag-review ng PSU kasi unang-una, not everyone is like Gamer Jesus who has specialized equipment which can monitor exactly how much power is going in and modify that power, let's say, if you want to test the overcurrent protection of a PSU. Hindi rin kami technicians na kayang buksan yung PSU and look at the inside and say, ganda niyan pre ha? But we do have something a lot of reviewers don't have and that's sample size over length of time. Basically, data. Since we're a shop, we have sold many FSP PSUs over the years. Different models, from their budget line to their more premium lines. And they are all very reliable. Wala nga ako maisip na may bumalik na FSP PSU for RMA which is very impressive. Part of that reliability comes from the fact that I think they are one of the very few PSU brands which actually manufactures their own PSUs. Many brands, kahit yung mga sikat like Corsair, do not make their own PSUs. They outsource the manufacturing to others. Pero hindi ganun si FSP. So overall, the brand is very reliable. For this particular model, it does have all Japanese capacitors which is another sign of quality and reliability. It also has the usual protections you want to have in a PSU. OCP, overcurrent protection, OVP, over voltage protection, SCP, short circuit protection, OPP, over power protection, OTP, over temperature protection, and UVP, under voltage protection. Alam mo na teleprompter ako kasi hindi ko kaya sabihin lahat ng acronyms na yon from memory. And again, to be honest, I could not test these protections directly. But I do know a local Philippine reviewer who I trust. He lives in a very brownout prone portion of our country. Ilang PSUs na daw namatay sa kanya. But he has started using the FSP Hydro series and so far so good. Going strong pa rin si PSU. On our end, we've been using this PSU in the shop continuously for around 6 weeks and so far have had no problems with it. Another indicator of the quality of the PSU is its 80 plus rating and this one is quite high at platinum. 80 plus only measures the efficiency of a PSU, not really its reliability or quality. However, it has become a stand-in for a quality rating since the thinking is to get higher efficiency from your PSU, you usually have to use quality components. This is a fully modular PSU which means you can remove any wires you don't need, which means easier cable management and just overall neater build. The wires do come labeled which more advanced users will disregard but it is nice for beginners. Last three notes, one, the included cables are not braided, they are just flat black plastic. Not a big deal for me, but some enthusiasts do appreciate the premium look of stock braided cables. Number two, the PSU also comes with extra cables for a second CPU. Two CPU systems at the consumer level are quite uncommon, but if you're looking to build one, then this is the PSU for you. Number three, the hydro in the name I think refers to the off-wet coating they apply to the PSU, meaning it's hydrophobic, it repels water. I did not want to splash water on the PSU to test this, so I'll take FSP's word on it. Joking aside, it's just marketing speak for components designed to last in a high humidity environment. Ang tawag nila dun ay harsh environment. Or as we call it, welcome to the Philippines. And if all else fails, this does have a 10 year warranty from the manufacturer. Actually, when I was making this review, my PSU, not FSP, failed on me. So I had to get this FSU PSU, and now it's powering my personal rig, so I do trust it to power my own hardware. We'll see how long it lasts, but so far, so good. Thanks for watching. And thank you to our top fans. Na afford na namin tungo puan nato. De joke lang. Thank you to Leah Magnaye, Ian Meru, Richard Onkinko, ITX Addict, John Ruben Ocha, Christian Espinosa, and Rafael James. Thank you for supporting the channel.